वेलकम टू इट्स टुमारो न्यूज आई एम हेना तलाटी माउंट एटना वॉल्केनो इन सदर्न इटली इराप्स हॉर्स फ्लाइट्स माउंट एटना द लार्जेस्ट वॉल्केनो इन यूरोप इरप्टेड अर्ली थर्सडे मॉर्निंग लोकल टाइम एंड इंटरप्टेड फ्लाइट ऑपरेशन एट द नियर बाय एयरपोर्ट located on the east coast of the sicily the volcano spewed enough ash into the air to halt flights coming in and out of the catania airport thursday morning the national institute of geophysics and volcanology detected an increase in strombolian activity on the volcano wednesday night this activity involves discrete explosive bursts that throw fierce volcanic material into the air according to the national park service Mount Etna has erupted multiple times this summer including one time in early August when it temporarily halted flights. Mount Etna one of the most active volcanoes in the world erupts so frequently due to its unique geological setting and it is located on the boundary between the African plate and the Eurasian plate where the African plate is being subducted beneath the Eurasian plate. This subduction generates significant pressure and heat causing the mantle to melt and form magma. Additionally, Etna's complex system of faults and fractures allows magma to rise more easily to the surface. The combination of these factors results in the continuous supply of magma leading to frequent eruptions. The volcano's activity is also fueled by its large magma chamber and presence of the multiple vents which provide various pathways for the magma to escape this geological complexity contributes to the regular and often spectacular eruptions of the mount etna in addition to its location on the tectonic boundary mount etna's frequent eruptions are influenced by the several other factors too the volcano sits atop the ionian microplate which is being squeezed between the larger african and eurasian plates adding further tectonic stress and contributing to the high volcanic activity the volcanic structure itself has a complex plumbing system with a deep magma chamber that fits smaller shallower reservoirs these reservoirs are interconnected by a network of conduits allowing magma to move quickly to the surface and that's all for now for more news updates stay tuned with us it's tomorrow news for more global weather updates like this subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates